<coughs> Life didn't always hurt this much. Once upon a time, the common man lived a simpler life by his own hand. But times were changing. The old way of life choking on the smoke of the chimneys. The woods caked in the black soot of the mines. The coal fueled the engine of progress. Brilliant ideas, like the steam train and its 16,000 miles of track. The world was transforming before our eyes, accelerating towards something much greater. an age of invention, where clever blokes were thinking up the unthinkable, sending messages across great distances, carrying voices through wires like magic, me, illuminating the streets and shops deep into the night. But the dirty secret of it all was the poor buggers in the factories, killing themselves in the name of the machine. Lucky to see their 20th birthday. The factories were no better than a bloody grave. Their deaths a meaningless sacrifice to line the pockets of the wealthy. I've seen too many starving families begging for scraps while the rich stuff their faces. Too many women dropping their knickers for a shilling while the upper class were a king's ransom. People did what they needed to survive. Which brings us back to me, where the fun was just beginning. The working class had been exploited long enough. The city needed a change, but I couldn't do it alone. You could call us organised. Eliminating our rivals, reclaiming our glorious empire, one borough at a time. Give it our best shot. Popping round for tea. Taking a stroll in the midnight air of jolly old London town. And with our growing influence, we turned our sights to greater injustices. The train baron. A man who put hundreds on the street because they stood in the path of his railway. A man who stole what he wanted from those who had nothing. But there was one thing he would never receive. Mercy. Well then, now you know what's required to join the rocks. Are you in? I'm in. Welcome to the family.